tits. The hell? All right, let's see here. What am I supposed to do? Ah, uh, fuck that shit. Commander, come and see me after you've spoken with the Krogan. Oh, fuck. This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the genophage, we can't destroy it. This has to be done. Saren's the enemy, not me. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. You want to destroy it. Help me out here, Shepard. The lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand. I don't have time for this shit. I don't care what your personal feelings are. This base gets destroyed. Don't push me, Shepard. I followed you because I wanted to fight for something more than credits. If you can't give me a better reason than this to destroy the hopes of my people, then I'm done with you. All you need to know is that I'm giving you an order to fall in line. That's it. All this time, and that's all I get from you. How can you not see what this means to the Krogan? This base can't be destroyed. I won't allow it. Saren doesn't care about these Krogan. They're tools, puppets. He'll destroy them as soon as they're no longer useful to him. Is that what you want for your people? No, we were tools. Sweet. All. I doubt Saren will be as generous. All right, Shepard. You've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. That's awesome, dude. I haven't gotten uh, an achievement in this game in a long fucking time. 114 2012 resolved impossible situation with charm or intimidate sweetness all right now we're ready to fuck some shit up talk to this bitch now thank you for speaking with the krogan the assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. You got a plan? I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Of sorts. We can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance. Crude, but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Where? Where do we take the nuke? And how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. Good. I prefer a straight fight anyway. It won't be that simple. We just don't have the numbers to meet them head on. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. I just hope you survive long enough to be useful. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. I don't make a habit of placing my people under someone else's command. I understand that this mission is too important for personal preferences to get in the way. He's right, Commander. We can't do this without both teams at their best. I volunteer. Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Solarians. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. 
Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? Williams, you'll accompany the captain. No heroics, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I'll have the ordinance Shit. loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? Fuck it. Let's do this. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. Well, this is it. Don't do anything stupid while I'm gone, LT. You too, Commander. We'll be fine. You'll see. Yeah, I just... Good luck. Is there something you want to say, Chief? I, I don't know. It's just weird going under someone else's command. I've got used to working with you. All of you. Don't worry. We'll see you on the other side. I know. I... It's been an honor serving with you, Commander. It doesn't matter if we're not in the same unit. We're still a team. Watch each other's backs, keep your eyes open, and fight like I know you can. We'll all come out of this in one piece. You bet, Commander. Okay. You all know the mission and what is at stake. I have come to trust each of you with my life. But I have also heard murmurs of discontent. I share your concerns. We are trained for espionage. We would be legends, but the records are sealed. Glorying in battle is not our way. Think of our heroes. A silent step who defeated a nation with a single shot. Or the ever alert who kept armies at bay with hidden rats. These giants do not seem to give us solace here, but they are not all that we are. Before the network, there was the fleet. Before diplomacy, there were soldiers. Our influence stopped the Rachni, but before that, we held the line. Our influence stopped the Krogan, but before that, we held the line. Our influence will stop Staren. In the battle today, we will hold the line. Good luck, Commander. I hope we will meet again. All right, so let's go with Caden. She's pretty much all tech. Check. Do you read me, Commander? Affirmative. Loud and clear. Good. We'll start our push. We'll try to make it to the AA guns, but it might be up to you to finish the job. So we are heading this direction. Let's go, guys. Shadow is on the ground. Repeat, Shadow is on the ground. Shadow is on the ground. Repeat, Shadow is on the ground. With a Gore team. Oh, teams. Move. Time to get some attention. Kind of far ranged there. Quick little sprint. Nice. Even though I didn't even fully hit him. Funnel by is under coordinated or him. Fire. Check for long range turrets helping the guest target. I'm supposed to go that way, I'm pretty sure. I was gonna check around that corner though just to make sure.
Boom. Did you see that? That's all it takes, baby. That is all it takes.